Hey folks, Whip here, and welcome back to Empire's SMP. Today, we've got a problem to deal with. This, this giant ice spike appeared out of nowhere while I was off on holiday, but I know exactly where it came from, Ribbon now. And we need to remove it so we can resume transporting ores from our mountain range all the way back to our fort. But we have to do this the Grimlands way with TNT. Now I gotta go find some. Will you find that like button and subscribe button down below the video? Nicely done, Flip. nicely done. It looks like I'm fresh out inside my chest over here. Just four baby TNT, but those don't quite work. And even my explosives box is out. That's unfortunate, but there's my bed. I've been looking for this everywhere. Maybe the shulker boxes up here in front of the mansion will have some TNT in them. There he is. Um, hi. What's that, going on? I've been looking for you. It's all time? your it's all your fault. What Quit? is my fault? What what is my fault? What, I, well, yeah, 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 yeah. They call me the cob boy now, not the cob father. Oh. <laughs> all right? And it's been a month, quick! A month? It's been a month! And I've been killing salmon left, right, and center, and it all leads me down to you. You're always for the salmon. Yeah, I'm just trying to keep them alive. Like, look at them. Look at them in here. They are they're helping. I put them to work, they got jobs. <laughs> They're contributing what? to society. They are evil, evil, and I'm trying to keep the cod going. Salmon apparently bad, according to you. Cod good. Mm -hmm. But all yeah. I've ever witnessed inside these lands is that just salmon are getting murdered. And, like, I... Sure, we've eaten some cod around here trying to stay alive and eat some food, but, like, we uh -huh. haven't murdered very many cod. Now, you've, you've killed cod. Like, you've... You've killed so many cod, right? You want me to, uh, let me just pull out my little statistics book over here and uh, see what it's saying. We've got, you have killed 94 cod. 94? 94. 94. Below 100. Zero zero. Two digits. Uh, how many salmon have you killed? Um, a little over 200, but that's that's a little different. That's a little, uh, some experiments have gone wrong and they've, yeah. they've, yeah. I think you might know, I've killed a lot of cod, but I've also oh, killed yeah, a lot yeah, of salmon. Yeah. I've killed a lot mm -hmm. of fish, actually, actually. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I've been I've been doing a little bit of research here, taking the tally across the entire server, Jimmy. And uh, I hate to be the one to tell you this, but you on the server have killed the most cod. No, no. I can we? I need you to stop killing. I know you haven't killed loads. It's been mostly me because I'm not getting my cod father head back, and I need it back because I'm okay, cod boy. Okay. So what yeah. if we instead? I won't touch another cod. Well, maybe, maybe only with a bucket to transport them to safety, but I, I won't, I won't do any more cod murdering. And what if you okay. try on the cod side, see if they, maybe we can preserve both and but we just don't... don't kill either. We obviously, I... you killing salmon hasn't worked to get you your head back. And look at, look at the rivers out here. They're, they're empty. True. You go tell the cod alliance and I'll go tell the witherose alliance. We'll get the word okay. out there that no more killing yeah. fishies of yeah. any yeah. way, shape or kind. I never thought I'd see this day. No, Cod and salmon. You know, Maybe working miracles, together. Miracles do happen. Well, I guess uh, we're now allied with Jimmy. Well, maybe an understanding. We have a mutual understanding. Just like me and the villagers. They generate emeralds for me, and then they buy those emeralds back. Yeah. Thanks, Leonard. But now for some TNT action. I think we just light it from the bottom and just send it. It'll be fine. We won't cause any problems, I'm sure. Definitely nothing will go wrong here, right? Yeah, it's fine. We'll, we'll figure it out. Oh, well, you know, if anything, in true Grimlands fashion, at least I destroyed it myself. I patched up the crater by covering it up with dirt and core dirt, and then cleared up the rest of the snow that was around the area and finally took the opportunity to clean up the podzol on the ground as well, turning this into a positive. Wow, a lot of gem students got lost on their way to the school. Y'all just go that way. Please go that way. Stop. No, I don't know. Nope, nope, nope. Come on, I'm asking gem to come help. I'm asking gem, please, nope. Murder them. Wow. <laughs> Just die! All of you die! Die! Somebody kill the banner boy! Somebody! No, I don't want to. I don't want to die. I don't. I don't want to die. I don't have my flint and steel, so I can't kill the banner boy. Where is it? How about you just live down there? You just you live down there now. Well, I guess if anything out of this, we've at least expanded our dirt area a little bit farther, and this weird black spot will not go away. The dark spot right here, nothing is above us. Yeah, there's a cloud, but it's Minecraft. Hopefully we found the spot and it'll correct itself. Otherwise, we're just gonna leave some torches over here. Nope, I did not. Torches it is. Well, it's not perfect, but this will have to do for now. At least we can get the minecarts moving again. 
I don't have too many trap doors left, so we'll just fill them in here where we can. And we're gonna have to do a little bit of a patchwork job over here. Very patchwork. Very, very patchwork. But it'll it'll hold. I think the minecarts can get across. This looks like it'll work. Yeah, you can barely tell it's different. Like nothing ever happened. But over here, we got Crystal Cliffs delivery. Check this out. Invited to the Crystal Cliffs Academy of Wizardry. I'm already the smartest, biggest brain person here on the server, and I'm gonna be a wizard. I'll be unstoppable. We'll hold on to this and uh, keep it with us and wander over to Jem's place here pretty soon. Okay, before we get over to Jem's, there's something very important that I need to be doing. While I was on vacation, uh, the crown got moved around quite a few different times, and apparently Catherine now has the crown. And her rule involves planting a field of flowers in our base somewhere. Oh, uh, it's class time? Oh God, did I, I'm already signed up for classes? I guess we gotta go pretty quick here, but I believe press button for flower, pit of death. That doesn't look very deadly. But anyways, press for flower. Okay, we have to create a white tulip field. Here we have a Catherine currently doing her intro as we can watch as she runs away. Will she spot me in the background? The world may never know. Will the cat tell her? I don't know. But we stay here until we find out. Look at her talking to the mysterious box in the sky. It's beautiful. A mastery at work. I think she sees me. I swear. I swear. Oh, hey, buddy. What's what? up? You, what? You're going to school too? Yeah, 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 yeah. Jem invited me over. I got, I got the invite. Oh, nice, nice. What's your uh, wizard robes, though? I, I'm, I'm wearing them. I got my wizard scarf on right now. It's a, it's a okay. multi-purpose tactical scarf for every situation. Tactical wizard. Okay, I like it. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. that's gonna be great. I can't, I can't believe this. Hello, hello, hello. hello. Hi. Do we get We're our ready. wizard hats now? Can I get a wizard hat, please? No. Are you here to accept your invitation? Yes. Yeah, I got yeah, an yeah. Idea. We thought the invite came with a complimentary wizard hat. No, yeah, it doesn't. Wow. Come up the stairs, please. I, mine be is yes. red. Oh, perfect. I'd like a red no. one. No. I would like a red and yellow one, please. No. Come here. Red and Thank black? you, please. No. Thank you so much. Here you go. The pot of sadness. <laughs> I'm going to call them this my video. tears. They're going to fill with my tears. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing great, buddy. <laughs> you should go to a drama school, not a wizard academy. Where is he? Hi, buddy. We're here for school. We're here for yeah, school. Here you go. Take this. Good. Wonderful. Give me your invitations. Oh, perfect. Good, good. I'm sure it got lost in the mail, but it, it finally arrived. Finally arrived. Yeah, it yep. took forever, Jim. No, I don't know what happened. It yeah. wasn't. The academy opened today. You, you, you got your invitation completely on time. Uh, this is our new professor, okay. Catherine. Hello. So when do we get to fire magic? Yeah. Never. Uh, Necromancy? Okay, now it's very important that you two learn to focus on your studies. So I've given you these grimoires. You can use them to take notes, to write things down. Whoops. Hold on, I'll delete it now. First day goals at magic school when okay, i need to delete make stuff. Hold a, on, give me a friend Done. these are your fellow students uh I they're they're here. working on things yeah yeah our, Hi, over Aries. on this side we have our potions wing this is where you'll learn all about potions Yay. right mm -hmm, in through mm -hmm, here mm -hmm. oh perfect i'll sit here wonderful wonderful Hi. the other wing we've been studying beasts lately but this is just a general classroom Actually, your first class is in herbology, so Catherine will take it from here. Have oh, fun. Bye. Hi, you're wrong. Hi, Catherine. Teacher. He's rude. He's rude. We don't. He's not my friend. First day goal is not going well. Perfect. Let's do it. What are we gonna blow up first? No, 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 no explosions yet. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Dear Diary, today was my first day at magic school and things are going great. My first class was with Professor Catherine in herbology, where we studied plants. I even got to name the class pet. Students, <laughs> students, say hello to, um, well, he doesn't have a name yet, so I would like you two to come Bumble up with butt. a name for our class pet. Bumblebutt Bumble is nice. I like Bumblebutt. Bumblebutt. Very nice. That's a that's a beautiful name. Okay. It's like Let's Dumbledore see. before a bee. Yeah, but Bumblebutt. Let's hang out in front of the classroom. After that, Catherine asked us to go out and gather our favorite flowers. Flower. You, I, you brought my flowers. <laughs> I brought Flower of Death. <laughs> and I brought first. poppies. I brought Lily nice. of Valley, also Flower oh. of Death. And oh, wow. we got Azure Bluets. Hey, Bumblebutt. Nice. Have a flower. Perfect. We even got to do some class projects, creating explosive potions. Bumblebutt, Bumblebutt, Bumble stand potion. back. Bumblebutt, stand back, please. 
Okay, I'm gonna throw the potion down. Whoop! Catherine, what did you do? <gasps> it's doing something. Catherine, what'd you do? <laughs> Everything went great until the final experiment. So I brought a blue orchid and some sand because I, I'm oh. trying to channel the ocean over here because we got the blue, we got the sandy beach, you know, we're, we're good. Very Let's see nice, what. very boop. nice. Boop. And a boop. I do, I do, it's ready. It's magical filled and boop. Look at that, <gasps> created life. A turtle life. egg. It's a that turtle. is so cool. This is so random. I can't believe that you created but, life. Well done, yes, A plus to you as well. Sweet. I can't believe this. Oh God! I'm getting out here now. He just he's killed it! Just killed it. Catherine, he just killed it! <laughs> just gonna create a life and took it away! <laughs> I did, I'm just gonna <laughs> sit here. I'm just gonna go here now. Okay, I'm oh sorry. Flip, flip, come back here. Oops. It was my first day though, so it's okay. We'll do better next time. After much time flying around, I finally have enough white tulips here so that we can actually make a little garden for ourselves, but my Wings are basically dead, so I've got to do a little bit of villager trading here for some experience. There we go, now we're patched up. Since everything in the Grimlands is, well, rather, uh, not a great environment to be growing white tulips too much, I thought we could send ourselves over here where things are still alive. I absolutely love this spot and I haven't done too much with it since we built the field. But that being said, I think we start off here with a little bit of a border using some of these acacia leaves. There we go, that should be a good enough spot and maybe we smooth this out just a touch more. And over here we can bring in a little bit of a front entrance where I'm thinking we do some spruce slab, another spruce slab, and then we come in the middle just to make it a little bit more interesting we do some trap doors. Yeah, that'll do. Then on the inside, just so somebody can be like working the area, we get a little grindstone right over here. We get the spruce fences and some oak trap doors. We've got a little bit of a wagon for people to work around here. Maybe a small sitting area at the front with a bench right over there. And we could do another bench right over here. And then from here, we just need to fill in all of the white tulips. And there we go. I think our white tulip garden is ready to rock. Except maybe we could fix it up a little bit more with some path blocks along the front. There, that's looking good. Now that we've completed the rule set forward by Emperor Catherine, we can now plot to take the crown for ourselves. It is time to get on the grind today, my friends, as we have a little bit of TNT right over here. However, I'm hoping to fill this entire box up. And we've got a lot of sand in here so far. And a ton of gunpowder. My goal today is to do a little bit of netherite mining. Reason being is we have a lot of things we need to be crafting in the future. And there goes all of my sand. Well, most of it. And we've got that much TNT. That should be able to work today. Well, that's a pretty full shulker box of TNT. Let's dive into the nether and uh, see how much netherite we can get. I'm assuming this is the best way to go to find unexploded lands in the nether, but it's all basalt delta. I've passed like seven bastions so far, and this is the first one that looks like it's untouched. So if we can get rid of all of the, the brutes, we could get some free ancient debris or netherite scraps up there. It's really unfortunate that this one is also full of hoglins. I've probably had smarter ideas, but here we are. Just slowly taking out all the monsters. I've run out of blocks, but here we are. How terribly can this go? I don't think there's any way for pigs to get me, so nope, snout. We got a snout, we got golden carrots. Smite four iron sword, blocks of gold, 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 gold any netherite <gasps> one ancient debris worth there's got to be another chest down here somewhere so i'm gonna keep looking there it is in the nether wart field all right i've taken out so many piglins i think i'm just gonna go for it rockets are in hand i see one right there nope there's lots oh they're everywhere they're everywhere look at them hiding in their little corners over there i think we've got them all now goodbye goodbye nobody else please not worth it not worth it at all let's go where I think right about here, we just dig down and see if we can get down to the netherite levels. Nope, we cannot. Looks like this one will do the trick though. So we are good to go, ready to farm the netherite or not. Well, if anything, it's time to get started. Let's create our first tunnel, all right? Never mind, nope, 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 not right there. We are trying this one. With that, one of the most profitable ancient debris mining sessions I have ever done got started. We got so much ancient debris out of just a few different tunnels that I used a bunch of TNT to explode all of these guys. As you can see here, it's constantly being revealed more and more ancient debris 
And holy cow, I never thought it would be this easy to get nearly a stack of the stuff after a while. It was so much fun. You know what, folks? I think this is some of the best returns we have ever had. 57 ancient debris for only one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven stacks of TNT. That is insane. Let's put that in the under chest and get out of here. That is, if I can remember which way I came from. I think it was this way. This looks like players have been here. And there we go, back home. Safe and sound in the forge where we can get this stuff smelting. It's a good thing we raided that bastion because I actually need some more gold over here. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, we've got 13. Any more gold? Please, please, just a little more gold. 14 netherite ingots. Oh, that feels good. Wait, we can make another? <laughs> I just need to smelt this ancient debris down and run into the nether to get a little bit more gold from the gold farm. But it's mostly rot and flush in here and a chicken. But here we go, netherite ingot number 15. Now that we've got all of our netherite stocked and ready to go, we are prepared for battle. But we not we might not need to go to battle after all. Catherine built an obstacle course, apparently. And if you can win the obstacle course, you get the crown. One way or another, we're getting it. Welcome to the race for the crown. The one who clears all six zones the fastest will get to rule the server. Who is going to be participating today? I don't, don't even need to try. Me. Don't even need to try. Just, I got this. I got oh, this. We're just watching. Already, What's, yeah, your we're What's your new oh, rule, Wesley? What's your new rule going to be? I'm already well, too powerful. You know, the uh, I'm going to be propping up my bakery business and make the rule that everybody has to eat only cookies. Oh, no. Oh, please, I don't win. You are evil. <laughs> to be fair, yes, mine, is, mine is no armor, <laughs> so I'm just playing off uh, the no, no armor. armor while I try no armor. Oh, my like gosh. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm just trying to bring everybody together and make people build some roads to each other. Come on now. How noble of no, you. Yeah, that's yeah I'm the good guy over here. I always have been. I <laughs> know, <laughs> Marks. Get set. Go. Uh, Woo! Oh, no, so bad. Oh, no. Oh, I'm doing it. Go, 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 go. <laughs> oh, the berries. No. <laughs> I am really bad at this. <laughs> Woo! Same. Oh, the horse is dying. The horse is dying. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, I can't oh, even see this whole thing on the horse. No. Okay. No. <laughs> Oh. Okay. Sorry, Lizzie's, go. Lizzie's, go pig right now. Lizzie's pig is following us, though. That oh, the pig! <laughs> oh, thanks for the boost. Thanks for the no! Oh, no! Oh, no. Oh, oh, no. Start no. over. Now Lizzie's in the lead. Get to the back, Flip. Oh, no! Ah. No! <laughs> um, there's interference from one no. of the No! Right on the track? Why are these fire arrows? <laughs> you know, you said this would be relaxing. It's actually very stressful. No, it's, it's very relaxing, Sky. It's very chill. No, very disagree. Zen. No, no. Why am I not catching anything? <laughs> I've been here for a Come on, Lizzie, come pick... catch the fish. You gotta catch a Did fish. You put catch fish. Oh, in this is my... pond? Uh, come on, fishy. Come on. So come stressful. on, fishy. Uh, just gotta Lizzie, I'm def I'm definitely got one. I'm, uh, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm just, I got it. Did you just... What? Are you cheating? Did you just I got the fish. You... I don't know. I got the fish. I got the fish. I got the fish. Just give me the crown, Catherine. What are you doing? Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Whip. It's Go. mine, it's mine, it's mine! I've got it! I've got it! <gasps> you, you cheated. It's mine! You cheated! Even, Even you murdered nope, Catherine! It's, mine. it's all fair, it's mine, I've got the crown, it's mine. I am your new ruler now. Nope, don't you try and rod me over here. Wow. That looks hideous on you. <laughs> oh! <laughs> How could you, Joel? How could you? I look fabulous, Flip, thank you. You cheated! Nope, 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 it's mine. Oh, it's mine. Where's <gasps> my stuff? <gasps> the prophecy. What? What, what? what is this? Whoa. Look at a all these flowers. What do you mean, what do you mean, <laughs> what do you mean the prophecy? What do you mean about the what? prophecy? Yeah, a what? great betrayal will wrench the hearts of rulers until a rain falls to cleanse the pain. You betrayed me like a flowers. Yeah, and you're well, welcome. You. Great things happen when I'm in charge. Look at that. Ha <laughs> <laughs> no, ha. Great things far, happen. But... My rule, as mentioned earlier, is everybody has to build a road to connect themselves up to another empire or to spawn. It's time to bring the world closer to home. And if you don't oh. do it, I'm taking your wings away. So you have to deal no. with the lack no. of having what? a road. No. Do not take my wings away, not again. Yeah, that's Quit already happened, be more original. The road. Your goggles have like eyebrows with that crown on. I'm very <laughs> angry right now with these eyebrows, Joel. Build the road. 
I will build the road. See ya, nerd. <laughs> well, my friends, I guess that changes things. Holy cow. I wasn't really expecting that, but I will take it. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, we will. And this Catherine head is very special. It's gonna get its very own spike out in front of the base. But we made the law of everybody has to join the Road Builders Guild. And that being said, we probably need a guild hall for everybody to, you know, join this set guild then they can all gather and build their roads from there and i think the perfect spot to throw the guild hall would be to start spawn town it has been far too long since anything has happened here i guess jimmy jimmy came along and added this for a merry christmas present for everybody to take some slime but this spot right over here it looks like somebody chopped a tree down ready to go for me to build a brand new build but i gotta get some blocks together first so let's get to it I'm over here playing this as if we're in hardcore mode, so if I need to instantly swap to my chest piece, I've got it on hand. But speaking of which, I've got pretty much all the items I think we're going to be needing with a few decoration options after the fact. Now, the final item I'm actually going to need here is from our toolsmiths, and I'm really hoping one of you trades a diamond shovel. Yes, there we go. Efficiency to diamond shovels. Let's see, how many can we get? Three. You know what? Three is a good start. With that, we are off to spawn where it is time to build the road builders hq where it is time to build the road builders guild hall in good old-fashioned time-lapse mode and there we have it the road builders guild hall is ready to go for all of our new members everybody on the server this is absolutely amazing the inside is decorated out we've got a nice warped floor in here being inviting and calming as people approach we've got some dirt that they're going to terraform their roadways with we got a block of diamond because it's a very great place so much trade coming through here and of course a few wither roses around the spot we've got our own little private quarters back here with some storage if we do need it and the shovel points to our book. Welcome to the Road Builders Guild. Emperor Fwip has decreed that you are now an official member of the guild. Woohoo! All guild members must build a new road connecting themselves to another empire or to spawn our current location where a road does not already exist. And roads can include pretty much anything. It doesn't have to be a path block road or something like that. After... Now, this is the very cool part. We are the first ruler to ever give a reward as being emperor. So once they've completed their road, we're going to be giving netherite shovels to every single person that completes their road. Failure to create a road will result in your elytra being taken away until you do create a road. Or we lose the crown, which will never happen, so it's fine. Now we just need to wait here for all of our happy neighbors to come through and pick up their shovels and get to work. Well, I guess shovels are supplied after the fact, but you get what I mean. There we have it, my friends. Fwip, ruler of the Grimlands, emperor of the server. I think next episode we need to build a throne room to commemorate this. But be on the lookout for everybody building up their roads. And if anybody says they don't want to, you tell me. But thank you all so very much for watching today's episode. Leave a like on the video if you did enjoy and are excited for more Empire's SMP content. Thank you all so very much for the support so far. Be sure to subscribe if you are brand new. And with that, my friends, I will catch you on the flip side.